Hi, everybody. Thanks so much for joining. Wanted to do a quick what sold video for this past week or so as far as postcards go. Postcards, as many of you know, my new obsession. Big fan, big, big fan. And I love to show off some cool cards once they sell. So let us begin right away with this very first item, which I sold during a live stream uh, last Friday on in October. Don't remember the date. But by the time you watch this, it might be a, a moot point what the date was. Anyway, this card sold, you can see it's uh, from the 70s, 73, it was postmarked. It's a chrome card from Wildwood down in New Jersey. It's just a shore town. And it is featuring this Caribbean hotel, motel. It's a multi-view. Here's a little blow-up of the item right here. You have the uh, the neon sign there. You have the cool cars from the 70s. You have a very kind of retro, modern look up there so anyway really quick seller this sold intraday i listed it i think it was around noon sold in two or three hours for 12 bucks and there's the back of it you see dwight d eisenhower on there a little information about the hotel itself so i'm really happy with that one you can't beat listing something and selling it the same day all right next up is a card that just sold earlier today you can see right there revere beach from massachusetts I met a girl, she's the candy kid. That's the title, which is what I put into my title. I did take a uh, best offer of six bucks. I had it up for $7.99. Six bucks is fine. Older card here. You can see the image there. It's like tinted, I believe. I like my home, but oh, you Revere Beach. And there's the back. It wasn't posted. Um, just a typical divided back card. Sold for $6. All these cards have been listed within the last week or so. Uh, at the time of recording so really quick movers on these which is probably part of the reason i'm so enamored by the postcard thing right now okay next up is this card which sold last night during my chat show it was a monday night chat show when this guy came through catalina island in california really popular and collectible for people you have a deep sea diver here uh oscar griffith sold for 6.99 uh, always offer the free shipping on these products on these cards that retail for 20 bucks or under using the ebay standard envelope shipping method happy with this one too just a diver on a rock against the water i don't know if that's really the water or a backdrop you could tell me there's the details on this gentleman what we saw at catalina and i'm very happy with that one too let's move on to the next one another california card here this is from pasadena the legendary new year's day tournament of roses parade this one is a chrome card you can see there's a a cancellation on the front of this one as well but there's the image of a girl going down the street in a, a float you can see it says tournament of roses here union pacific railroad and a station it looks like big big crowd and this one was posted uh late 50s in 1959 you can see the date up here too oh my birthday 128 there you go nice easy sell again this one was for six bucks within a week or so of listing it very happy with this one here is yet another card that sold during a show, a best offer. I accepted for six bucks on this one. It seemed to be right in line with the comps for this item. It's the Women's uh, Union Building in Fall River, Massachusetts. Cool old car in the corner. I'm sure that helped sell it. There's the back, postmark back in 1909, divided back. Next up is a really attractive uh, white border card. It was posted in 1917. It's a street in Mobile, Alabama. St. Joseph Street, as a matter of fact. And again, look at that thing. The horse and buggy, horse and carriage. Nice tree-lined street. Very pretty card. Posted back in 1917. Sold this one for 9 bucks. Then the final one for this video. Log Cabin, first house in Downingtown, Chester County, Pennsylvania. Postcard, rustic scene. Kind of a cool-looking card. It's over 10 bucks. Has an ambiance about it. I like the coloring. It's got a little staining and whatnot over here. But again, the, the great thing about... Um, listing these things using your duplex scanners it reveals everything and it's very apparent if there's some issues with the card there's no surprises there's the back it's in uh, i guess that's a divided back with this little slit over there but posted back in 1911 really happy with this one 10 bucks out the door it goes huge fan of the postcards as i mentioned in a previous video i continue to list them i have about 400 and change listed so far uh, picked up another lot of 500 a couple of days ago. Can't wait to get them listed. So we're on our way now. Hopefully we'll get up to a thousand really quickly within a week or so. 
and the ball keeps on rolling. So it's a great time. Thank you so much for taking the time to watch the video. Please give a big thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Consider subscribing to the channel if you haven't done so already. If you already have done so, thank you very much. Make sure you hit that notification bell icon so you'll know whenever I post a new video or go live with one of my live shows. So thanks again very much, everybody. Have a great day. Bye-bye.